Jay makes us six. Hi everyone, I'm Lorena and welcome or welcome back to our channel. As you can see by the title, today we are sharing a laundry room makeover. As you can see, it's quite small and it's currently cluttered and unorganized, to be honest, as you can see. In today's video, I'm collaborating with British Paints Australia for DIY July. These two white storage cabinets will receive the most beautiful makeover. Are you ready? If you're not subscribed, please do so. Like and comment down below. To get this storage cabinet DIY on its way, my first stop is Bunnings Warehouse, where I need to choose from the large variety of colours. British Paints is only available at Bunnings Warehouse so next time you're in store, stop and check out the samples. I asked via Instagram story for help deciding on the colour I should paint the cabinets and Slender Pine was the most popular one. You will have to keep watching to see what I decided on. But at this point, I'd love to give a huge shout out to Monica at the paint desk at Bunnings Warehouse she was professional and so very helpful. Here are all the DIY supplies I was kindly gifted by British Paints Australia to use in my DIY. Huge, huge, huge thank you to British Paints for giving me this opportunity to share my creativity. Now I'm using sugar soap to give these cabinets a really good scrubbing and that they definitely need and I'm lucky to have the help of my youngest daughter Chiara you will see her pop in shortly now how satisfying is the scrubbing <laughs> do you enjoy cleaning content well if you do here's some for you now I'd bought these cabinets years ago um, from Fantastic Furniture and I actually had them in my salon. I used to have a beauty salon for those who didn't know. So these two cabinets were used to store all my wax products, facial products, etc, etc. And um, so once I closed the business I actually obviously brought them into my home and they have been so needed here in this particular home where we're renting at the moment um, yeah storage is such a big necessity now I'm removing the hardware and I always recommend that you keep them together in this case I won't be reusing these handles but I always find it just keep them together so you've got the screws and the handle all in the one little bag Next, it's on to unscrewing the doors and the brackets and removing the doors. This can take a bit of time, let me tell you, but it needs to be done. Labeling, I also recommend highly, recommend that you label each bracket and door um, and it will just make it so much easier once you're putting it all back together. Again, a shout out to my daughter, Chiara. She has been such a huge help with this project. So I'm so thankful to her. Thank you, Chiara, if you're watching. And here you go. You can see my organization skills. Next, it's on to the sanding. Now, a light sand will help remove any shine. It also cultivating a more adhesive area for your primer or paint. Now look at the cabinets. Yes, they are huge. And what I'm happy with is that some shelves are actually removable. So that will help with the painting. But yes, they are huge. And I've committed to do both these cabinets. 
<laughs> Next, it's time to prime. Now, I would really highly recommend that you speak to a professional and ask what primer will work best with your project. This primer here, I have to say, was absolutely perfection. I loved just the way it was applied. It really was a top, top quality primer that I highly recommend. So I have given a coat of the primer to the shelves and the cabinets and it really looks <laughs> so much better just with primer on it and I still have the doors left to do which I might have to get to tomorrow. Okay, it's the next day. So yesterday I managed to completely finish the first coat of the primer and now I'm on to second coat. These are the shelves that um, are removable and uh, these shelves have been primed twice already. So now I'm going to get ready to paint them, give them a nice coat of this gorgeous colour which I can't wait to show you what it is. So yes, I decided on Secluded Avenue. As we know, Sage is the 2022 colour of the year. So I just, my heart was set on that colour and that's the colour I decided. The product is the British Paints H2O Enamel. It's a semi-gloss. It's water-based. The benefits are it's non-yellowing. It's easy to water wash. It's low odour, which 100% I can agree. It is fast drying. Yes, 100%. And it can be used inside or outside. Now, disclaimer, I am no professional painter. But let me say, British Paints applies so perfectly and so uh, just amazingly, like the coverage is flawless that I can almost feel like I'm a professional painter. <laughs> um, as you will see as um, the video continues, using British Paint is completely, completely transforming my old cabinets to new. So here you can see one cabinet is almost fully painted. You can have um, a little look of me <laughs> being a professional painter, not. <laughs> so now onto the next cabinet. And I'm just wondering, do you find painting, watching someone paint satisfying or even painting yourself? Do you enjoy it? Comment down below, I'd love to know. So I think it's enough talking now and what I'll allow you to do is just listen to some music and enjoy the painting. Stranger, what's going on? 
So much has changed since you've been gone I kind of miss how we both used to be We used to talk about the little things, the ups and downs So are you happy now? Cause I just can't figure it out I know Been talking every night until the morning light Memories so far away This cut the units have been done Yay! So here are the shelves and they have had two coats of paint and they look amazing. All I've got left to do now is the doors. So we get in there. So while I'm painting, I thought I'd share with you a little about British Paints Australia. So British Paints Australia has been trusted by Australians for 80 years. It provides high quality products that make any wall, deck, door, ceiling, trim, and in my case, storage cabinets and vases look their best. Their products are developed for everyday Australians and every sort of Australian home. No matter the project you're working on, you can trust British Paints to do the job every time. Sold only at Bunnings Warehouse, this allows you to shop for all your DIYs, essentials at the one shop. Comment down below and let me know what you think of my colour choice, Secluded Avenue. Next day guys, and now I need to paint the other side of these doors. So let's get into it. The more and more I see this gorgeous paint color, the more I just fall in love with it. It is just such a beautiful sage green. It's so beautiful and I'm really, happy that I stuck to my creative instincts and decided against you know the, the, the color that seemed to be most popular and just went with you know my intuition my creative intuition I guess you can say and I'm so so ecstatic with how beautiful this color looks on these cabinets it just it's honestly just making them transform into such beautiful storage cabinets but please let me add I do really appreciate those that took the time to give their vote towards the color on Instagram I really do appreciate that you took the time to just you know help me out um, kind of guide me in that direction um, and yeah, I just, I just, I just hope I didn't come across um, in the wrong way. I do actually really appreciate, um, you know, the help, the advice, um, suggestions. I always take it on, um, and at the end of the day, you know, sometimes I do go ahead with what Instagram has voted, and then there's times where, just like this time that I've decided against. Um, you know my Instagram followers and I've just gone bang into a different direction but similar direction because they're both you know in the green family of color tones so this um, <laughs> cabinet transformation is becoming a family event <laughs> so now I have my amazing husband Ricky and my son Matthew my older son Matthew and they're um, helping put the doors the brackets all back together um, they're doing it the smart way with a drill where I didn't use a drill I use a screwdriver so that actually took longer to remove the doors so I'm just so thank you so if you are here watching to my husband Ricky and to my son Matthew I really appreciate that you took the time to help 
and yeah I'm just so proud that um, this cabinet or well, these cabinets have just come out so beautifully the hardware the gold hardware that gold brassy kind of hardware um, these are also were from Bunnings and I'm just so pleased with how beautiful they look with the sage green it's just gorgeous I'm just so happy comment down below and let me know your thoughts and what you think of these cabinets I'm just over the moon Feels like time's passing me by too quickly It feels like I'm running with my eyes closed Why are these seconds so easy to pass me? I only notice them when they go Yes, I was always looking for the future While regretting the chances I slipped in the past They say time will slowly but passes fast Moving on as we grow Take a second to pause the scene Before these moments turn into memories Sometimes I sit by myself and just be Reflect on the moments that passed me by Various memories flash in front of me Nevertheless, it leaves me Now let me remind you of what the laundry and the cabinets looked prior to this extreme makeover. And now here's the reveal. Thank you so much to each and every one of you for watching this video. A huge thank you to British Paints Australia. I'm so grateful that you gave me this opportunity to show my creativity for DIY July. This has been a huge project but so rewarding to see how amazing the cabinets have turned out and giving me the opportunity to make over my laundry room, which desperately needed it. <laughs> so thank you everyone for watching. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do so. Tap the bell and 
leave a comment down below let me know what you thought of today's video so much more exciting content coming our way soon so i'll see you guys next time and thank you so much for watching